This is an apocalyptic version of Red Dead Redemption 2. Okay, so I'm not really sure what's going on with the city. A bunch of people started acting weird. Um, and I, just everyone's shooting right now. I have no idea what's going on. I don't know what these things are. Oh my gosh, they see me. Oh my goodness, that thing's ugly. I have no idea what this is. Come on, run, 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 run. Oh my god. Okay, I found this little, uh, little alleyway. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. I think I'll, I'll probably be safe in here, I think. Okay, I haven't seen one yet. I'm oh my goodness, they're- Now, how they got video footage of that, I have no idea. But, I will be spending the next 100 days here. I've also created four new settlements across the entire map. My goal is to reach each and every one. Let me just tell you, the last settlement is nearly impossible to reach. But we're not there yet. Right now, we have to start where it all began. All the way on day one. On day one, of course, I was in the middle of the desert, with, as you can see, nothing on me. Okay, you guys can already see that there are a bunch of zombies forming already, oh my gosh. My goal right now is to get a weapon and a horse, because both are going to be very crucial over the next 100 days. Oh my goodness, all these zombies are already all over me. If this is what it's gonna be like the next 100 days, my friends, it is going to be a long 100 days. I need a weapon. Okay, I see a guy shooting some of these zombies right now. I'm gonna have to take it from him. I'm sorry, sir. I, I feel bad. I'm so sorry. Oh my goodness. Okay. Pick up the weapon. Hello, zombie. Pick up the weapon. Oh my goodness. How many? Okay. I have to be careful. I cannot shoot anymore. Now, I'll need to be very conservative with my ammo because as of right now, I only have seven bullets. Okay. I really want to shoot that zombie, but I, I don't have any bullets to spare, unfortunately. Well, now that I got a weapon, my goal is to now find slash steal a horse. The first town I visited was the town called Tumbleweed. Okay, I've made it to Tumbleweed. Um, oh. Stop where you stand. I think there's... Who's over here? You came to the right man to die. Oh, it's a sheriff. The sheriff, how, how are things going, sheriff? Alright. <laughs> okay. Oh my goodness. Okay, I need a horse. Oh. Uh, sheriff, you just had one of your... Sheriff, you just had somebody escape from jail. <laughs> Is there anything in there? Oh my... Nope. Absolutely not. There was a roar. Absolutely not. Okay. I'm gonna get this horse here. Alright. Come on, horsey. Let's go! Well, I officially have my first horse. Day one has been a huge success. Now, I don't really want to name him yet because I don't know if he's gonna survive long enough, so we'll see. On day two, I went out for more loot, but... Okay. I think this house would be pretty nice. <laughs> Alright, then. <laughs> well, I guess I'm, uh, I guess I'm not getting loot here. <laughs> I ended up going past a gang hideout, and what I haven't told you is that these hideouts are all over the entire map, and they can pack some serious loot. However, they are very dangerous, and if you don't have anything on you, well, you're gonna need to make sure you pick your fights wisely. I decided to not engage, and I found a nice secluded spot at the end of my second day. I showered, drank some water, and good night. On day three, my goal was to get to the town of Blackwater. On my way there, I found a spot with some pretty nice loot. Okay, this is this is good. I need, I'm gonna need some of this loot. I'm gonna need all this. Oh my gosh, here we go. First zombie kill. That's official, my friends. That's official. What you got for me? I looted up some more around the area. Obviously, if I'm gonna survive the next 100 days, I'll need to grab everything I see. So I did that, and I was off. All right, that was a, that was a good little haul, my friends. Oh my goodness, am I getting? Okay, what I haven't told you is there can be random ambushes sometimes as well. And I think I'm getting... Yeah, I'm getting a, I'm getting a small random ambush. I'm not dying here. Not yet. We just started. Get out of here. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. Man, this is, this, is getting, this is harder than I thought so far. After my sudden attack, I found a local man. Hello, sir. Listen, I uh, don't want to cause any trouble. Just want to get some loot here, all right? <laughs> How you doing today? Okay, calm down. Okay, oh, my goodness. Calm down. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, please, 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 please. Okay, I'm out of ammo. I just gotta tackle him. I'm gonna have to tackle him. No, oh, I'm sorry, sir. It's a doggy dog world out there. Oh. Yikes. Alright, let's see what he's got for me. Ooh, a double action revolver. Alright, that's not bad. Alright, hang on the boot. Let's see what he's got in here. What do we got? What do we got? What do we got? Okay, we got some chewing tobacco, cigar. And I don't want to be rude, so I'm gonna close that. And what do you got for me, my friend? Okay, some revolver ammo. Ooh, and a 
I ended up running into this very interesting man, and though I didn't know it at the time, he might as well have saved my life and became very important over the next 100 days. Check this guy out right here. I don't know what he's... Yeah, you see this here? Yeah, what is it? American ginseng. Oh. Take a feller from not too bad to hardy as buck in no time. Okay. Really I like something. it. Does I'll take that. Medicine, give it some zip. Okay. Believe me. Anyway, I ain't gonna use all of this, so feel free to help Absolutely. yourself with whatever's left. Thanks. Be well, friend. What a nice guy. What a great guy. Just like that, I finally made it to Blackwater. Okay, this town is in complete shambles, my friend. Look at that. Look at that zombie just running. Oh my god, I gotta get up top. I gotta get on a, on a high ground somewhere. Wait, what is that? Is th It's a cat! Now, I couldn't believe my eyes when I saw this cat. Oh my- Look at him run! Look at him run! And if you didn't know, I'm a huge cat person. I have two beautiful boys of my own, so seeing this cat kind of reminded me of them. He likes me, guys! Look at- He likes me! He likes me! Oh my goodness. Where are you going? Where are you go Come back. Oh. Where are we going? I'll follow you. Okay. Look at how cute he is. Oh my. Oh my goodness. <laughs> oh my. I'm coming down. Holy moly. Are you okay? Okay. Oh, he doesn't want to come down because there's a barrier here. Here. I'm going to. Here. I'm going to climb up here. And then I'm going to help you, kitty. Okay. All right. I'm coming to you. Oh my. Eventually he got down and we were able to head out from there. Oh my, he's just following me. God, look at look how cute he is. He's just following me. I mean, I think we're going to have to have him for the whole rest of the time, y'all. On day 4, we found ourselves a nice little spot on a mountain. This looks like a nice little spot to camp out with our new friend. We're going to have to name him at some point. Um oh. Get away. Oh my goodness. I don't know why they sound like bears. Oh my goodness. Oh, this one's got a knife. This one's got a knife. You gotta be careful with this one. Oh. I, I don't know. I don't know why you're meowing. You haven't done anything. I was out here working. Okay. Okay, maybe it wasn't so nice, but things got a little crazy between me and Mr. Cuddles. That's right, I, I named him. Anyways, Mr. Cuddle told me something pretty interesting. I want to see the city. I want to live there so bad. Please help me get there. Also, if you're watching, you should subscribe. Now, I have no idea why Mr. Cuddles actually wants to go to the city. All I know is that I was already gonna go there, as it's on the list of settlements. But, this gives me an even bigger purpose. On day five, we set off to reach our first settlement, Strawberry. Well, 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 we got ourselves a little bit of a band-aid camp here. Don't mind if I do. What we got? We got health cure. Nice, nice. Little zombie. Coffee grounds and some moonshine. But unfortunately, the settlement was occupied by hostile people. So I left Mr. Cuddles up on the mountain and just went myself. Okay, obviously there are a bunch of hostile individuals here, so I'm gonna have to be careful. Very, very careful. Excuse me, sir! Oh my goodness. Oh, did I kill him? Okay, he's gonna be back. He's gonna be a problem. Unless he- unless I wounded him. Okay, let's head down and let's enter our first settlement. We've made it, my friends, to Strawberry. Okay, the only thing left for me to do here is just to clear it out, and so far, I haven't seen anybody. Oh, I've forgotten these settlements, you can also get other types of weapons. Okay, let me check in this one first. Does anybody in here come out? Okay, no one's in here. I think most of them are over by that bridge over there. Oh crap, 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 crap. Hide, Arthur! Oh my goodness. Hide, hide, hide. Alright. I'm gonna go around, I'm not gonna just face him head on, I'm gonna go around and I'm gonna try to be sneaky here, do a little parkour action. I don't know where the other one is. Oh, there's one. All right, I'm just gonna go up on the on the roof here. Come on, get up there, get up there. Okay, I see him. Okay, I'm gonna have to be careful here. I don't have a lot of ammo. I have to make sure I'm conservative. Come on, peek your head, peek your head, peek your head. Okay. Got him. All right. Wow, that was one shot I got him on. What does he have for me? Okay, he had a, he had a little bit of something, something. Oh, okay, some chewing tobacco. Is anybody in here? Is that- This is why you go to the settlements, my friends. You can get yourself a sniper. Oh my goodness. I think I have, like, some of the best weapons already. That's pretty lucky. Alright. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh! I think that was the last one. After clearing out the settlement, I looted up as much as I could from what was left in the general store. 
I am about to have as much loot as possible. Like, I, I'm about to be stacked here. All this bourbon on me. Oh my goodness. I'm gonna have enough supplies for days. Days and days I'm gonna have enough supplies. Went up the hill and I did something, well, very special. I named our horse. I named him Jerky. I mean, come on. I mean, Gretz is a great name right here. Jerky's a great name and he's been with us for a while now, so hey. On day six, I had my eyes set on something important. It was a hat. Now, I know what you're thinking. Really? Why do you care this much about a hat? Well, I don't have a good reason other than the fact that uh, I want it because it looks really, really cool. One problem though, it requires a perfect beaver pelt. Now to get a perfect beaver pelt, you need to get an animal that has three stars and you must kill it cleanly. If not, then you won't get a perfect pelt and it'll be two or one stars. On my way to get this beaver pelt, we ended up passing another settlement on day seven. Welcome to Valentine. Alright, let's get some of this cheese and let's loot up in this general store. Oof, candy. Uh, I don't know, I don't know. You know what? I'm gonna treat myself, I'm only gonna have one. Alright. It was mostly the same thing in the general store, looted up quickly, and this time though, I got a bow. Oh yes, I got a bow. I can use this for the beaver. I can use it for the beaver. And I'll be honest with you, all I can think about right now is that beaver hat. I was heading my way to a specific spot that was known to have beavers. And on my way there, I killed a deer. Come on, just fall down. Don't make this difficult. Don't make it difficult. Oh, I don't want to hear you like that. Oh, okay. All right. Well, we got ourselves some dinner here. And we are off, my friends. Let's look at that beaver. I'm excited. I, I'm, I'm feeling good about this. I'm feeling real good about this. Now, when I tell you I ran into some problems with this beaver, I ran into some problems. On day 10, I killed my first beaver. Okay, that's a three-star beaver, my friends. Three-star beaver, that's perfect. I'm just gonna hit him right in the head, it should be perfect. Get myself a nice purple pelt right away. Let's go check it out, let's go check it out. All right, what a subverted one star. Oh, only one star? Okay. I thought my gun might have been a little too hard. On day 12, I decided to stab a beaver. Come here, beaver! Come here! Okay, that's gotta be a per perfect one, right? One, how? I guess again, a little too hard. But on day 13 and 14, I used a bow instead. Again, what the heck is going on? No perfect pelt of three stars after I kill it. Now, I found out that you can only use a specific gun to kill this beaver in order to get a perfect pelt. And no, I did not look it up. YouTube, I'm gonna show you how to get the perfect beaver pelt. If you haven't already, make sure to like and oh, subscribe. Now I traveled all the way back to Valentine's Settlement, and I'll be honest with you, it's it's day 20 now, okay? I wasted so much time trying to get this hat. I, I, I literally gave up. And then, there's no way. And when I say that there's no way, like I, you're, if you guys don't know what I'm talking about, this is the exact gun you need to kill the beaver. <laughs> Come here, beaver. I'm getting him this time. The, right there. Three star, perfect beaver. Come here. I need this. This means the world to me, please. Please tell me that's three. Please tell me that's three. Yes! On day 22, I took my perfect beaver pelt to the trapper, and well, I did it. <laughs> Words will not be able to describe to you how proud I am of getting this beaver hat. I mean, it's just so cool. But reality checked back in. Mr. Cuddle still wants to live in the city. The final settlement in the city is nearly impossible to get, so I wasted so many days getting this darn beaver hat. It's okay. Because I got the beaver hat. On day 25, I decided to take down my first bandit outpost. This outpost was pretty wide open, and I wasted so much resources and energy on this beaver hat. Okay, I'll, I'll stop. I'll stop bringing up the beaver hat now. So I got to work. Okay, Here, here's the game plan, ladies and gentlemen. We're just gonna go on guns blazing. We don't have a single game plan here other than the fact that we're gonna get it going. Okay, right here. Got him. All right, it's time for work. How did they see me, though? I'm, okay. I am kind of in the open. Dead eye this guy. Move around. I'm gonna need a new gun. Come here. All right, work time. Here we go. Come here, come here. Okay, there are a lot more of them than I thought. Hurry up. Loop, 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 loop. Move, move. Bob and weave. Bink. Skelet. Oh yeah, I'm feeling this. I'm feeling this. As long as I keep using my dead eye, I mean, I can't be stopped. Okay, they're falling down now. Okay, there could not be many more of them, I swear. Yes, 
thank goodness. Oh my goodness, let's loot. I looted up all the bodies, and hey, I even found a dinosaur. Oh my goodness, that's actually, that's really cool. Looted up some more and got some snake oil, horse stimulant, and lastly, I got some ammo and a miracle tonic. At this point, it's time for me to do something a bit different on day 30. I decided to, well, I decided to create a base. All right, this is a nice little spot for thy base with Mr. Cuddles and Jerky and I. I mean, this is, this is gonna be a nice little spot right up here, overlooking a beautiful view by a nice little bridge. All right. Yes, this is it my friends. This is the one. All right jerky I'm gonna hit you up here, and I gotta get to work. I gotta make myself a nice little fort. Oh, yeah And if you've seen any of my videos, you know that I am a master base builder I mean just look for yourself and if you somehow have a problem with this design Well, you can talk to mr. Cuddles about it because it was his idea I decided to check out my surrounding area. All right, mr. Cuddles you gonna follow me. Oh, this is not creepy at all. That was really satisfying. And well, look at this awesome camera angle. I mean, isn't isn't that cool? I mean, somebody should make a postcard out of it or something. That is awesome. In that same day, I found an abandoned house. And well, well, every scary movie tells you to not go into the scary door, but we're gonna do it anyways. Anything in here? Nothing. Oh, well, of course, of course. All right. Um, let's loot up quick and let's get out of here. Coffee grounds. You know, I love me some coffee. I, I think that's it. I don't want to. Oh, oh my goodness. Hello, sir. Oh my gosh. Don't run in here. <laughs> don't run in here. Die already. Holy moly. Walk moly. Sorry, jerky. Let's get out of here, man. The whole day was kind of weird. I saw a horde, didn't want to engage, but I did make coffee. I don't know, but there's something very satisfying about making coffee in this game. It's like. It's just, it's just so satisfying. But I haven't forgotten about the main goal, and that is getting to the last settlement. And well, it's day 30 now, and I'm gonna need to gather up some serious resources if I'm gonna be ready for that challenge. Day 35 came across, and I was lucky to find an abandoned camp. Okay, I don't, there's no one here, I don't think. Most of it was bare though, but I came across a chest, and you won't believe what was in it. Nothing was in it. I just I just wanted to be dramatic. Mostly everything was uh, pretty bare. I'm away home though. I was attacked by a horde. Okay, get away from me. Get away from me, zombies infected. Get away. Gosh, how many are there? It's not even nighttime right now. They must have just all sniffed me or something. I don't know. No, 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 no. Oh my gosh. Of course I had to reload. Oh my gosh, it's piecing me up. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Okay. Um, jerky is somewhere, but jerky, come here. Oh gosh. Mr. Cuddles, stay close. These things are not nice. Okay. I get my get my hat. Oh my goodness, of course there are more coming. Of course there are more coming. Let's go, jerky. Mr. Cuddles, come on. Let's get out of here. Alright, I'm running out of road right now. Honestly, I'm doing this to myself, but we're just gonna kill them all here. I'm standing strong. I'm standing strong, ladies and gentlemen. We're gonna die the man's way. We're gonna die the way Arthur Morgan would want to die. But we're not dying. Come on, zombies. Let's go. That's all you got. Let's go. I shouldn't get too cocky. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. Stay back. Stay back. Stay back. Mr. Cuddles, come here. I think there's only, like, one more. One more. Come here, Grandma. Oh. Well, that was a little bit more eventful than I thought it was going to be. But, hey, what are you going to do? All right. I'm just going to throw you down. Does he, does he go off the full cliff? That was very satisfying. <laughs> All right, let's go. Looted the bodies. Didn't really get much. On day 45, though, I realized that the fort I built wasn't really in the best place. So I looked to see if I could find a better location for a fort. This place is absolutely beautiful. I mean, wow. I haven't even seen... I've never been to this place, I think. Okay. Let's go. Ooh, look at this. This is a nice place. This is a nice place for another fort right here. This is going to be our safest, I think. I found a nice spot, and I got to work. Well, ladies and gentlemen, here it is. Again, if you have a problem with this design, you can talk to Mr. Cuddles about it. He was the one who suggested it. And of course, I had some coffee. But drinking coffee is cool and all, but I need to get some more materials. So I set out to see what was around my surrounding area. All right. So every time I go to explore around my area, it seems that there's a problem. <laughs> oh my god. That actually freaked me out. I did not know it was a bear there. Okay, come on, come on, come on. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Okay, well, I'm just gonna have to get off you, jerky. I'm going down here. Okay. Don't slip. No! Okay. I could probably get back up. I could probably get back up. Oh my god! Where is. What is going on? What is going on right now? 
Go back up. Go. Oh, of course. Oh, we got a knife too. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. you for good extra measure. Holy moly guacamole. Okay. I haven't heard the bear. There's no chance that... Are you serious? There's no way that those zombies actually killed that grizzly bear. <gasps> they did. There's a skeleton and what looked like Micah. Get out of here. Well. At least we got ourselves some, uh, some dinner. Where'd you come from? Get out of here. Holy moly guacamole. Can't catch a break. On day 50, my base was attacked for the first okay, time. Okay, I, I literally can't catch a break around here. This was this is the least safest place so far. Okay, we're holding true so far. Get out of here, sir. I'm sorry. Gosh, where are these bandits keep coming from? Alright. We got the dual wield action right now. We got rid of our other revolver a while ago. I don't... Okay. Infected action. Come here, sir. Come here, oh my gosh. Oh, he's piecing me up. And, oh, perfect. perfect. Alright, a little health cure. Alright, I'm feeling it. We should be able to hit, stay strong, I hope. Oh, is that everybody? Oh, we got one more. We got one more. Oh, oh nope, nope, nope. I did not want to fall, but that's alright. That's okay. I think that was the last one of them. I don't I don't think there are anymore. Ooh, that's not a pretty sight. After successfully surviving the attack. I felt confident, so I decided to do something I had never done before. Attack abandoned camp at night. Bang. Yeah, he was a bad guy. Easily the most dangerous time to be out. So on day 65, I told Mr. Cuddles that I was going to Whole Foods, which is the opposite of dangerous. It's actually the safest place you can get your food. And no, this is this is actually not a sponsor at all. You know, it's um... But hey, you know, Whole Foods. <laughs> Already I could tell this was going to be difficult because the infected were pretty large and kind of adding in numbers. Yeah, this is uh, this is not a good sign, my friends. This is uh, this is pretty terrifying. I'm not, I'm not even gonna lie to you. Again, look at that awesome camera shot. Wow, that is that is so cool. What is? Oh my gosh, what is going on up here? What is going on up here? Okay. Die, wolf! Wolf, die! Okay, this this wolf is not dying at all. How you doing, sir? Oh, you don't look good, my man. I guess I can give him some some of the bourbon. There you go. Take my resources. The limited resources I have. I don't. He's not gonna make it. I don't think. All right. Moment of silence for our friend, my friends. All right. Let's loot him. <laughs> okay. All right. Oh, ooh, he actually had throwing knives and a perfect snake skin. That, wow. Okay. Again, we don't really have much plan here, other than the fact that I think we're just gonna go guns blazing here. Um, yeah, maybe I'll start with this guy, but I'm not really sure. Of course, there are infected here. Okay, I'm gonna try to take just these three out quickly, quietly with the knife. Sorry, sir. Okay, I'm gonna head up here a little bit more. I don't know if there are any. Okay. Oh my gosh, I think I might have alerted infected. No, 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 no. Absolutely not. Is he? He just dodged that. Come here! Oh my goodness. Yeah, this isn't this isn't good. Not at all. Sorry, ma'am. Oh my how many are there? Nope. Nope. Oh my gosh. Alright, jerky! Oh my gosh! Okay, at this point I've already alerted myself to the other gang members down there. Oh my gosh. Get away, get away, get away. None of them are killing him right away. Darn it. Bye! No, 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 no! Okay, I just have to- No, oh my gosh. I just have to go. I just gotta go! Okay. Oh my gosh, I get- Please don't- oh. that, that is the most annoying out of all of them. Alright. Got my other revolver. Alright, uh, I think I'm just gonna have to head down. There's no reason for me to fight these all by myself. Alright, you know what, I'm, I'm not leaving, we're, 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 we're gonna try to get some loot here, we're gonna try to get some loot here, you ready to play fellas? Let's do it, let's run it right here, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, don't think I haven't thought about you guys, we're not leaving, we're not leaving until we get at least a little bit of loot, oh my gosh, I 
don't know how many more there are. I can go around for circles for what feels like literally forever. <laughs> okay, there's only gotta be like a few more here. Okay, I believe that there's... Oh, four. Okay, never mind. Now we have an answer at least. Get there. Actually, you know what? We're going around. Actually, infected, kill him! Infected, kill him! I think, I'll, I think that'll be the, that'll, that's the last one, right? <laughs> yes! Okay, let's get some loot. At least I hope I can get some loot. There's so many infected out right now. Okay, let's see. Let me try and loot. Can I loot? Can I loot him? I don't remember loot. Oh my goodness! Um. Oh my gosh! Yeah, I'm just gonna have to go up here. Can't go in there. Unfortunately, my friends, we are not going to be able to lose anything because their infected is increasing very much so. That really, really sucks. I'll be honest, it's been over 60 days now, and that final settlement seems really scary, concerning. I don't have any loot at all, really. And, you know, I haven't even ran into a single nice person. I came by a camp to see if I could, you know, get some nice hospitality and, and some nice people, but... Hey there, hey guys. Bun. This is uh no place for you. Hi. Enough. You cannot seek friendship of me. Not now. Good morning, ma'am. None of us have anything to say. Well, jerky Mr. Cuddles, I'm sorry. They did not like us at all, actually. Um, I don't know if I'm missing something there, but um, I have not seen a single nice person so far. On day 75, I finally made it to the south, and I really don't have much loot, but hey, what are you gonna do? If you spend all that time getting a beaver hat, this is what happens. Sorry, I, I, I shouldn't have brought it up again. However, I made it to my third settlement, Rose. I'll be honest, this place was awesome. There were some really nice people here. People that weren't trying to hurt me or kill me. This place is actually beautiful. And I think there's gonna be some nice people here too. Some hospitality. And I went right to the saloon. I can't believe they have a working saloon still. I mean, this this is awesome. I wanna go in and see what's going on. Hello? Oh my gosh, there's people here. There's actual people here. There's a card game going on upstairs. There's a gun here. Oh my gosh. And let me just say, it was so nice interacting with real people. But I forgot, this wasn't just about me. It was also about Mr. Cuddles, wanting to make it to the city. And selfishly, I just wanted to stay and play cards with real people. But still, I needed to do it for Cuddles. On day 85, I decided to go out and take down another bandit camp. And well, okay. I think this will probably be the last bandit camp I try to take down, honestly. But we'll see. Oh, of course, I'm getting ambushed here by a couple other people. Leave me alone. This might not work out. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Get out of here. Oh my gosh. Get away. Jerky. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh. Oh. Wow. Wow. Here's some food. Here's some, to eat it all. Oh my god. That was too close of a call, so I decided to stay close to the road settlement. For the coming days, I crafted up all the materials that I had on me, and then it hit me. I was able to craft a special healthcare potion, which is something I would have never been able to craft or thought about if it wasn't for that man at the beginning of my journey. I really didn't do much for the remaining days except wait till day 99. This was going to be an all or nothing, one attempt fight till the morning of day 100. Because the way you get into the settlement, you either die trying, or you survive and you live to get in. And it was time to fight on day 99. Well, ladies and gentlemen, I hope you're ready. I hope you have your popcorn. I hope you have your snacks because this is the finale. You're not going to get any better finale in a movie theater or anything. This is it. We have to somehow get through this little whatever this is. Check it out, everybody. It's a complete chaos around here. Okay. I'm going to leave Jerky here because I don't want to get hurt and I already have my hat shot off. I already have my hat shot off. All right. I'm going to hide in the bushes. Bob and Weave is my, my goal party here. We just have to survive until morning. Okay, we just gotta survive until morning. That's all we gotta do. Die. Die. Oh my gosh. Look at how many are. This is the Wild West out here. There's infected and there are just normal bandits. Go on, jerky. 
I'm gonna need you to take me a little bit further away. Oh my gosh! Okay, just run, just run, just run. Jerky, Jerky, come here, please. Oh, I know you're getting shot at. I know you're getting shot at, boy. Here, come on, come on, come on. At least take me with you. At least take me with you. Oh. Oh my goodness! Look at how many people there are. Okay. I crafted these for a reason. Let's use them. Oh, I don't want to get burned. Stay alive. Stay alive. Stay alive. Stay alive. I want to go into a barn. That's my goal right now. Let's get into a barn. Get into a barn and I think we'll be okay. Okay, I'm in a cornfield right now or, or, or whatever this field is. Cotton field. I, I can't see anything. I can't see absolutely anything. I I'm just running through here. I don't know how they can see me. Maybe they can't. I mean, I have a big light on. I'm just, just going to shoot. Shoot randomly. I don't recommend this strategy at all. Just go. Just go. Finally found a barn. Okay, um, I'm getting up here. I'm getting up here. This is my spot right here. I hopefully just stay here for the rest of the night until the morning comes. Oh my goodness! I just realized I'm getting low on revolver ammo here. I'm getting real low. I don't know what I'm gonna do if I'm gonna run out of ammo. I don't have my other guns on me. Jerky is where somewhere. Please die. Please die. There you go. Okay. Alright. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. I have, I have very limited ammo. One more. Oh my gosh. That was my last one. Alright. Fire. Eat it. Eat it. Eat it. I was able to get a couple more. Alright, I'm grabbing this. I'm grabbing this. Shotgun's mine. Alright, let's uh, let's head down. Oh my gosh, is that a zombie with a gun? Holy moly. I'm telling you, they, re they really are crazy out here. I wasn't lying about this settlement, my friends. The sun's coming up. The sun's coming up. Oh my gosh, the sun's coming up. I just gotta hold up on this roof for a little bit longer. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Look at these zombies with guns. Come on, come on, come on. I think this is it, my friends. Oh my gosh. It's morning. They have to be dying off now. I mean, there's a few more here. Jerky! Oh, I'm so happy you're okay. Get, get out of here. How many more are there? Oh, this last guy, get out of here. Okay, Jerky, let's go get Mr. Cuddles. Mr. Cuddles! I'll make sure he's okay. Mr. Cuddles! Oh my god, is he okay? There he is! Ah! Well, Mr. Cuddles, are you ready to go to St. Denis? I love to hear it. I did it. I made it to the final settlement of St. Denis. I still didn't know why Mr. Cuddles wanted to be here so bad, and well, in that moment, it hit me. Family. <laughs>